John Joya is the chairman of the Contra Costa County Board of Supervisors. County Supervisor John Joya. John Joya. County Supervisor John Joya. John Goya. John Goya. John Goya. John Joya. Mr. John Joya. Contra Costa County Supervisor John Joya. Let me tell you a little about myself. Well, city and county leaders are stepping up to stop what appears to be a feud between two gangs in Richmond. Supervisor Joya says he's determined to come up with a solution for peace. It's more than just about putting police officers in the street. We want to make sure that our streets are safe for kids, for adults, for seniors. Deanna Green was going to turn three years old next month, but she died this week. This young girl was in foster care. What we're doing at the county level is to look at all the systems and determine if there can be an improvement in the system so that you can get more agencies talking to each other sooner with more information. Contra Costa County supervisors adopted a zero tolerance policy against domestic violence. Devote more resources early on in the process before the battering becomes even more violent. Supervisor John Joya says getting antibiotics from the butcher is bad medicine. They could go several blocks away to the county health clinic where they can receive free medical care. It doesn't matter if they have insurance or not. What we did today was, is, is the city of Richmond, the county of Contra Costa, erased our lines and we worked together with Richmond Sanitary to clean trash up from the streets, from vacant lots, from people's homes. It make me feel good just to have a community clean. We don't don't have to let the community get like this. Lawn care and landscaping are big deals at the Breakers, a planned community surrounding the bay in Richmond. They have homeowners rules and John Goya is in violation. We're in a six year of drought and asking homeowners to use more water so that their lawn is lush green is not appropriate under those circumstances. John Joya coordinates the cleanup each year. I think our aim is basically to remove all the visible garbage off the beach and in the marshlands. Apparently, it's also caused a big bureaucratic stink. This is the first time many agencies have dealt with a, a beached uh, whale. And so it was a question of finding out who had authority over the whale. The new environmental justice policy would mandate more monitoring of expansion and the impact on residents. Most industrial facilities are located in lower income communities and communities of color, so they disproportionately get a larger share of the kinds of industries that negatively impact their health. What was supposed to be a demonstration turned into a celebration in front of San Pablo's Doctors Medical Center. The help comes from Contra Costa supervisors who announced a tentative plan to save West County's only hospital. County Supervisor John Joya also convinced the board to include a shelter for families. What is important is we're searching uh, um, an ability to have extra services so that what we have is a gateway out of homelessness, not just a roof over people's head. Essentially what Mark and I are hoping is that our plan on smart growth get considered at the same time that we're voting on the urban limit line. Joining us now from San Francisco is John Joya, a member of the Contra Costa County Board of Supervisors. That county is five miles away from Oakland and doesn't want the super uh, center either. Why not? Good evening, Bill. Well, our county is about a million people, and what we did is pass a law that says we want to make sure that we receive sales tax revenue from large, big box retail stores. We don't want our residents subsidizing the largest corporation in All the right, world. All right, fine. Now, listen, you, you, I just want to tell Mr. Joya, we appreciate you coming yes. on, but you're going to have a referendum on, and that's why I love California, because you have a referendum will. in we March, will. right? Will. We will. We're looking forward to the voters of Contra right. Costa debating this issue. Absolutely. We know Walmart's going to spend over a million dollars let on the this. people decide, and that's why right. this is good. But you Have know that what? referendum. Walmart doesn't want the people to decide. In well, we'll Diego. see. I don't care what Walmart They're wants. They're fighting it in Let them vote. Mr. Joya, thanks very much. Thank you very much. He has a plan to fill county vending machines with healthy foods. Good morning, John. Good morning, Ross. Hey, good what's your you. plan? Well, basically, it's to provide uh, the public more choices when they come into a county uh, building and use a vending machine. You'll have more than just M&Ms and, and Snickers bars as a choice. You'll have healthy choices as well. Are you a healthy eater? You know, um, most of the time, but I'll, I'm what, guilty. What, what, I, love a I love a good Scharfenberger chocolate. Oh, well, I don't blame you. What did you have for breakfast this morning? You know, I didn't have time to have breakfast oh, this morning. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Try to get around the question soon, that soon, way. A good, huh? a good latte and a croissant. <laughs> All right.
there's always room to improve a system, and I think that's what we're trying to do.